I guess I'm really lucky I never was bullied for having red hair and so I can't imagine what that would feel like. In my opinion, the bullying that happens towards redheads is a very indirect kind of um, exclusion. When I was really little, little girls didn't want to always approach me um, because I didn't look the same as them. And I was seriously just as cool, but it took them a little while because I didn't blend into the crowd. The ridiculous nicknames that they come up with, Carrot Top, Big Red. It can be tough because you just want to be like everybody else, especially during your adolescent years. I didn't really date in high school. I th think that probably had something to do with it. I always noticed while growing up that in the movies, all the bullies were the redheads. So it always made it seem like um, the redheaded boy, especially, was the vicious, ferocious little rascal. I think that for some reason, it's like less acceptable to be a guy and have red hair. And I think that's that doesn't make any sense to me. And it's just like, human nature to kind of pick on the ones that aren't like everyone else. So it's not surprising, but I think that it's wrong. I have never really been bullied about it, possibly because my sister got all of that. She was not one to take crap from anyone. I, I guess she taught me the same thing. People didn't think it was a positive thing, but they've learned to realize that like, that's cool. Whenever I see like a little kid, I always like compliment them and go out of my way. You know, if there's any young girls out there, young boys that haven't embraced it yet, hang in there. There will come a time when you realize you're so beautiful and so different and you'll embrace your differences and, and realize that's what makes you so special. Think more like, oh, I'm just so unique that of course I'm not gonna be represented that much in the media. Just realize that you are your own person and you're perfect the way you are.